Meantime, new this morning, the police sergeant who was shot in the head in Forest Ranch is now on the move. Fox has Elizabeth Alvarez joining us live now with the new developments in his recovery. Elizabeth. Good morning, guys. You are looking at uh, a medical transport that is about to happen. We are here at uh, Air Care airway. This is a private, semi-private signature terminal here at the San Diego International Airport. And inside this air care ambulance is Sergeant Anthony Elliott. You'll recall Sergeant Elliott was seriously wounded two weeks ago tonight. He was shot in the head in a forest ranch shopping center in the line of duty. He is now going to be medically transported out of state. This is the next step in his recovery process. And there is a motorcade here, uh, presence of San Diego police officers, as well as uh, those close to Sergeant Elliott. And I'm going to walk over this way since that ambulance is now behind the gate again, Sergeant Elliot being transported out of state as part of his recovery. Uh, this we just got word that this was happening not too long ago, and we've been in close contact with uh, the San Diego Police Department ever since um, that that night, which again was exactly two weeks ago tonight. And I want to show you uh, the motorcade here. These are the officers. There's probably about 20 motor police officers who escorted Sergeant Elliott from Scripps Memorial in La Jolla here down here to the airport again at Signature Air. This is a semi private uh, terminal. And these are his fellow police officers who Again, escorted Sergeant Elliott uh, down here in show of support. So, as you know, we have been following all of the developments with what happened that night. Uh, Sergeant Elliott seriously wounded. He was shot in the head in the line of duty uh, at that Forest Ranch shopping center. His care remains critical, although seriously injured, and we did recently uh, see images of him in the hospital with his wife, Laura, by his side. Uh, when we saw those images, obviously the, his fellow police officers and his family were pleased to see that he was able to smile, uh, but he has a long road uh, to recover, they tell us. Uh, the sergeant and other officers were responding two weeks ago to reports that a stolen vehicle was linked to a suspect in this Forest Ranch shopping center. They managed to track that suspect down inside of a Ralph's. Well, that suspect tried running and then shot at police, shooting Sergeant Elliott in the head. And so once again, back out here live, we have a group of his fellow officers who just uh, were part of the motorcade transporting Sergeant Elliott, uh, where Sergeant Elliott will uh, take a private aircraft and be flown out of state to a medical facility. So we wanted to bring you this live since we have been covering uh, what happened and of course uh, we'll be keeping close tabs on his recovery. Guys, we will send things back to you for now. I'm sure we'll have more of an update from the San Diego Police Department uh, later today. But as you can imagine, anytime an officer is wounded, uh, the community, not only the police department community, but uh, the San Diego community gets together.